Hey guys, it's Anna. Um, I'm here with Newton, my sweet little boy. He's been following me all over this morning. Um, I'm here to check on my um, dinosaur plant climbing blueberry and um, I can't remember what the other one was, but I saw some activity in these and I'm guessing it's the free plant that they gave me. Um, with the purchase, um, I put them here in my <coughs> window and just in some used egg cartons. I find these so wonderful to um, plant stuff in. I use these to germinate my uh, hot peppers and yeah, especially stuff that likes humidity to like a um, like a greenhouse that you can create. So, I'm going to pause this and see what's going on. So, nothing's going on in the climbing blueberry, the um, apple berry, quote unquote, um, pod. I gave it a little more water and I love this because, you know, they create little domes. Oh. But you can also put a little slip of paper for what seat it was, and they snap in place. Um, I'm going to pause this again and show you what else. So, this is why I like this method. Um, it provides a lot of humidity, you can see. Um, and in this, I still have nothing. It's okay, though. Wait. I might have one growth right there. Um, I don't know what that is, but if it is a bet flower, then I will care for it. Such. <coughs> um, so, thanks to PP, I actually got a water bottle and I actually poked a hole in it. I just like that water a little bit. It has so much humidity in the top, I really don't have to worry about much. So I'm going to pause this again and see what else I have. Now this is the dinosaur plant. It's a um, relative of uh, rhubarb and um, I got five seeds. I think one of the five seeds. Yeah, I don't know what I put in here, but I still watered it. Um, I, 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 yeah, it's a relative of the rhubarb. Um, same method goes for every seedling that I try to create. These little things do wonderful. Um, and I'll put this somewhere real quick, um, and I'll show you something else. Now. Sorry. Now, um, I'm going to cross rows with these two. Um, one has obviously sprouted, and when I close it, they get bent. Um, I think I'm going to leave this open and close this one <clears throat> for the most part. Um, the seeds I have on the side that have not germinated are um, like a wild um, pink ginger orchid. Um, I'm guessing it's just a ginger species that grows well. Um, and these are a poppy mix. Um, that I got for purchasing uh, the plants that I did, like the the dinosaur egg, the bat plant and everything, she gave away uh, free seeds with the purchase. Um, I do have other seeds that I did not want to plant because I have no space. I live in a house and it's about to be winter. So I planted the poppies because I love 
puppies. They're very lanky. Um, so we'll see how they do. I'll give you another update soon. Um, the reason I like the cage method is because you can put the labels into them without any distress to, like, I could reuse this, say, time and time again, um, without having to mark it, like, I knew I was going to have to mark this, um, gingers, I knew the, the puppies would, um, show up first. So, thanks for watching. Um, I'm a little sleepy, but I will talk to you later. Bye.